have an idea of what the equation for standard form is? Yes, John. The equation for standard form is ax plus by equals c. John, you are correct. The equation for standard form is ax plus by equals c. Does anybody know the equation for slope-intercept form? Teacher, teacher. The equation for the slope-intercept form is y equals mx plus b. EJ, you are correct. The equation for slope intercept form is y equals mx plus b. Can I have Skyler and Lyrics come up and solve these two equations? Okay, Lyrics, let's go. Here are your markers. Here's a standard form equation. I'm gonna convert it to slope intercept form, which is y equals m x plus b. Excuse my handwriting. In order to isolate y, like how it is here, I have to minus eight on both sides. Which leaves me with four y equals negative 8x plus 16 and now we have 4y which is actually 4 times y and in order to undo that I have to divide 4 cancels out I'm left with y equals negative 2x plus 4 which is your answer good job lyrics So the equation is in standard form and what I'm trying to do is put it into slope intercept form. So the formula for slope intercept form is y equals mx plus b. And to do that I minus 6x on both sides and I'll get 3y equals negative 6x plus 21. So to leave my y alone, I divide everything by 3, and I'll get y equals negative 2x plus 7. Good job, Skylar. Okay, class, that would uh, conclude my lesson for today. Good morning, class. My name is Mr. Tabella, and we are going to be starting off with preliminaries. So, can I have Dan to come up and solve this? Could I please have Miguel come up to help Dan solve this equation? So first, you need to find the number that, that can be multiplied 5 times to get 32, and that number is 2. So 2 times 2 times 2 and then multiply the first two numbers and continue from there. 2 times 2 is 4, 4 times 2 is 8. 8 times 2 is 16, 16 times 2 is 32. Oh, thank you, I think I did. Good job, Miguel and Dan, please have a seat. Thank you. Please have Joseph to come up and solve this equation. So, to get to solve this, you have to think of a number that when you multiply three times, you will get 27. In this case, it will be three. And to prove that, you multiply three, three times, and you'll get 27. Uh, three times three will be nine, and nine times three will be 27. Good job, Joseph. This will conclude my lesson. Have a nice day. Hey, 
I'm just, you know, um, I have a, something to tell you. I uh, really like you. Home. Bro, you're a loser, bro. You're a waste of our time, bro. Yeah, bro. Jack, Jack. Oh, we target people yeah. like you. Jack shit. You're a loser, bro. You're a loser. Get your ass out of here, bro. bro. <laughs> Guys, let's let's help him out. Come on, guys. Hey, man, do you need help to pass this class? Um, yeah, that would be great. Just keep up with your aims. Listen during lectures and take notes. Ask questions when you're confused. Hmm, maybe I should follow their advice. It might help me. Thank <laughs> you. 
You are indeed correct, John. The equation for standard form is AX plus B1 What? What do you mean? Wait, really? Equals. 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 Plus C. Equals. Plus equals C. Huh? Plus C. Equals C. Equals C. Dude, I yeah, equals C. Yeah, equals C. I'm gonna. Oh, John. Yeah, go shout out. Three, two, one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, there's the equals. <laughs> Again, so what I learned from this class was that I learned from else is that you have to learn this to slope intercept form, which is why you should be Good job, Skyler. Okay, class, that will uh, conclude my lesson for today. Guys, come on! Why are you so sorry? Okay, okay. Can I please have Joseph's... Uh, <laughs> 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 Can I please have Joseph's... Joseph! Because come to my...